We're learning more tonight about a hostage situation in Somerville. That happened yesterday on North Cedar Street. Police say they responded at around 1 to a call about a man pointing a gun at a woman's head. That man was then taken into custody later on in the day, and today he faced a judge in bond court. News 2, Sophia Arizosa has been following the story closely. Come spring in Somerville, the blooms are the focus. It's always a chill town, quiet. But this Friday in Flower Town, the talk of Main Street was somewhere else. I got a lot of texts and calls making sure I was okay. Um, it was definitely shared all over Facebook. An active scene on North Cedar Street. Businesses evacuated and the street blocked off by Somerville police as an armed man allegedly refused to release a hostage. He eventually let the woman go, and today that man, Wesley Ford Heatherly, faced a judge in bond court. I had no intentions whatsoever of hurting anyone. The victim, who chose not to be on camera, said the two were going through a divorce. I just felt like the kids were better off and everyone was better off without me and I, I just wanted to know the truth before I went. The judge denied bond for Heather Lee's kidnapping charge. The news comes as a relief for those who were on the scene. That does make me feel better. It really does. Mary Ellen Budd works at the neighboring flower shop. She says this served as a learning lesson. It can happen anywhere. You never know, you, you never know what's going to happen. And Somerville is no exception. Just because of one bad incident doesn't mean this is a bad area. It's a wonderful, safe place. Heatherly has several charges against him. He received a $200,000 surety bond for domestic violence in a high and aggravated nature and a $100,000 surety bond for possession of a weapon during a violent crime. There are still unanswered questions. Police say arrest records will be available on Monday. Reporting tonight in studio, Sophia Arizoza, News 2.